Dressed in their white coats, students from Red Mountain Elementary in Ivins arrive at Rocky Vista University for another hour of learning. The fifth graders are followed this year by students from Diamond Valley, who have also been given the opportunity to expand their horizons in the field of medicine. Each week they come as a different topic. So for example, the first time that they came, they studied uh, the immune system and germs and learned about that. Uh, the next time they came, they studied about the heart and the cardiovascular system. On this day, the students are learning about the field of dentistry from Dr. Whitehead, who helped initiate this program. What if we got kids from the elementary schools that could come and, and learn about the things that it would take for them to be a, a doctor, a physician. Every other Friday, the students take a tour to get to see what real students in the medical program do when learning to become doctors. Absolutely thrilling and humbling because I was that little kid. I'm here because of investments and mentorship that's been made to me when I was a little girl. And um, this is, for me, this is my way of paying back. They're old enough to have some basic learning but they're young enough to be very, very receptive. About 30 fifth graders from each class are given a tour through the School of Medicine from current medical students. It's been one of the most rewarding things I've done so far at school. I enjoy going and hanging out with the kids and see them and see them and have them answer the questions and learn something. The unique program started in 2018. Supporters on the RVU Advisory Council hope to expand it in the future as it's currently the only program of its kind in the state of Utah. But we call it the Young Doctors Program because we're hoping that a certain number of these children are going to become doctors. There's a shortage of doctors in this country, especially those in the primary care areas that are going to deal with the majority of, pe of people who need to visit doctors in their lifetime. Students were impressed by the use of yeah. real human skulls for real. learning. It is cool, you know, it really is. The body is amazing. Not only do the students learn about different medical fields they could go into, but they also get to go back into their classrooms and report on what they might be interested in to their classmates. You have to learn about every single part of the body. You have to learn about different sports. You have to learn about how you can um, mend wounds and fix um, sprained wrists. Well, I did um, hematology and oncology and I don't really know why I chose that. I just thought, oh, this would be something really cool and new to learn. And I'm going to become a vet, but I, I went to this because people on animals are kind of like, they just have hearts, blood, organs, veins, and this can help me in my future life when I become a veterinarian. So. At the end of the semester, the students will graduate from this program knowing they have earned their real doctor's coats. The goal of this program is to be able to give the, ex the students experiences, um, to get them insight and say, you know what, yeah, I could do a career in medicine. Like, that's not out of the realm of possibility. Um, sometimes they want to be a doctor, but they never get to be it because they don't have the education that they like need to be. And this like program will help kids that want to be doctors get the education they need. So my big dream is to eventually be the physician and work in the emergency room and help all those people that come through that door. From Rocky Vista University, Melissa Anderson, Community Education News.